Hello guys and welcome back to Axangel RC. I have yet another update on the Nano Talon and I assume this is a much anticipated one as it touches on the topic of the plane's row instability and turbulent conditions and a possible fix for that. These so-called strakes were brought to my attention by an RC Groups member with the nick Alice Cooper who made and tested them first and he and some other people did report some improvements on the performance of their Nano Talons so I decided I'd give it a try as well. I drew up and printed out the strakes using the suggested dimensions but also made sure to design them so they would be easily removable just so I can test out a few configurations if needed and so I can remove them easily if they don't work out for some reason. The front part of the strakes mounts to the plastic bits that come already installed in the Nano Talons hatch while for the rear bolts I glued some nuts on the underside of the hatch where the nuts can screw into and hold the strakes down securely. Good news is that even with this addition the plane is still able to be packed back in its original box and it really doesn't affect assembly speed at all. So I decided to do four tests this day. First test with strakes on, second test with strakes off. Then I would change the pifs a bit so I can test out some that were provided by another RC Groups user Pawn FD. Now I will show you the first and second flight side by side and will actually speed up the footage a bit. Hopefully we'll be able to more clearly see if there is any difference between the two as I was really not sure about the effects this thing had. In case in case you're impatient, you can skip one minute ahead. So can you see a difference between the one with the strakes and the one without them? Honestly, I am hard pressed to find much of a difference and if there is an improvement with the strakes on, it is minimal and hard to note, at least in these conditions. Now, keep in mind that my talent does not have any other mods related to the row instability, whereas other guys that tested these, if I remember correctly, did have quite a few other mods trying to correct the issue. So perhaps strakes alone will just not cut it and the nano talent might need one or two mods in addition to get the full benefit. As it stands now, my first test did not yield a concrete answer whether the strakes improve anything on their own. So for the next two tests I changed my pifs to the new ones that were given to me and again flew the nano talent both with and without the strakes. In all honesty I could definitely feel the nano talent a bit more locked in regardless of the strakes. It was quicker to return to level when it was pushed around and felt a bit more stable for sure. These pifs came from a highly modified nano talent though where they do make a difference but since mine is not nearly as modified I assume the lack of a more notable difference is due to this. So again take a look at the two videos side by side for a bit sped up to 200% and see if you can tell the difference between them.
aside from the more locked in feel and the slightly smaller amplitude of the rocking due to the new piffs, the situation is pretty much the same as before. I can't be certain that the strakes are helping much. And if they are doing anything, the effect with them alone is minimal and perhaps they need something more in addition. Even looking at all four flights at the same time next to one another, I still see that row wobble with or without the strakes and with the old and new piffs. And that means only one thing. I will need to print out another strake to see if they will make any noticeable difference and then I might either put winglets or perhaps vortex generators might be a better idea and see which mod in addition to the strakes would make the largest improvement. As it happens the nano talent is so efficient because it is pretty clean and streamlined on the outside so I will have to be careful and try not to add too many drag creating mods in trying to fix this issue. I am sorry my test did not yield more notable evidence of the effect of the strakes on their own on the behavior of the nano talent but even this tells us that this plane will require more than one mod to fix the roll wobble unless you want to fly it at least 500 meters above the ground at all times where the wind is not turbulent which is not an option for most people. Now if you have found this video at least a little bit useful please like share and subscribe if you haven't already and also hit that bell icon next to the subscribe button so you can be notified when I upload a new video. Also consider following me on Facebook for more regular updates. All relevant items featured in this video have been linked below and buying anything via those links would help support this channel. Another way to support me would be Patreon, the link for that is in the description as well. No matter which way you do it, all support is appreciated more than you know and I would like to thank all who have chosen to do so. Happy flying and until next time.